Hey guys, welcome back. Today we'll be reviewing set number 40567. <coughs> hmm. Hey guys, welcome back. Today we'll be reviewing set number 40567. This is the Forest Hideout Castle system. This is obviously part of the 90 years of play. 18 years and up, even though it looks like it could be for younger ages, although this is 90 years of play. So this is basically like a collector's item. And you got two of the forest hideouts. Uh, not forest hideout. The forest men. I should say forest men and women. This is a basically based off the version that was released 90 years ago of the old forest men hideout. You got some nice little detailing, trees in the treehouse like hideout. You got some of the shields. You got basically look, looking like a Robin Hood guy with a gold in his hand. You got a mushroom. You got a forest woman. You got her sh sword and her spear, almost a shield, whoops. You got a little archer area for him to practice. You got their gold, their weapons. Ladder going up into the little lookout area. And just basically, that's pretty much it. So this is our little hideout. Now, this was only released as a promotional set. If you spent a certain amount of money, you would get this for free. Now, I went along the, pretty much the smart route, and I got two of them. I might just open, I'm gonna open up this one, but this one I think I'm just gonna save. Now, you're probably wondering what I bought to get those two. So, one thing that I bought with that set, with one of those, was the Medieval Blacksmith, which is a very cool looking set, a little medieval set, a set I've been wanting for a long time. And, you already know that it's medieval, you probably know the other set I got. No, it is not a second blacksmith, although that would be cool. I got the three in one medieval castle. You're probably worth thinking it was 90 years of play medieval castle. No, that's a lot of money right now. <laughs> Wish I was like them YouTubers that had bank on bank of cash, but that's the little ones, the free little ones. But we won't be building those now. We'll just be building the hideouts. So we will open this up and get down to review. So this is the build all built. It's like a nice little hidden little hideout for the forestman. Guys, is like a big black tree. It does open up. You see them inside. It comes with a little archery stand. So look at the figures. So for figures, we have two forestmen, one man, one girl. The girl is holding a sword, and she does have you no know, face on the back. It does come with her brown hair and a ponytail. And both their outfits are the same. Back printing is the same with the belt and the rest of the cloth piece with a red collar and green tunic with a little pouch for any gold they find. Come with the red sleeves, green pants. Basically red and green is their main colors. And the man is like a, basically he is, looks like a Robin Hood kind of style. He's got his quiver with his arrows, he's got his bow and arrow, one already drawn, ready to fire. And he comes with his hat, which looks like a Robin Hood hat with a little red feather shooting out. He's got a nice smile, he's got a goatee and some sideburns and some bushy eyebrows. No back, no back printing for the face, but that's fine. Next up we have the build itself. So you do get this little archery stand. 
Maxwell brick built archery stand. Shoot the arrows at for practice. On the bottom of the build, you got a mushroom, a little tree, and some flowers, only yellow flowers. And then you got some little leaves and plants building up to the top to the main little tree area. The set is nicely built using mostly black and green as its pieces, but black is the main color of this. Up here you got a little stash area and a extra sword. Get this out. There we go. In it is just some gold that they've had. That they've stolen from the rich for the poor. An old sword. Got a little area for them to come through. This is basically the door area. I put that in my hand. A little door area, come right through. On the other side, they'll have the ladder leading up to the crow's nest. Oh, that's fires. To the uh, little tower, little watchtower area. Got two, one window on each side, two windows in the front. See from looking out area or sniping with the bow and arrow. On top does come with a little red flag and a blue roof. The roof does come up so you can lay with the bigger inside. Put that down. You can position the little bent branches anywhere you want. Most of them do move. Mostly just these giant ones. The other ones can move, but it does look good the way it was intended to look. And it comes with little shields in the front. They both have a elk, I believe. So you got an elk or reindeer on them for the Forestman logo. And all in all, this is a really cool set. You can probably find this now, probably maybe in the 50, 60 range of dollars, because this was an exclusive set for a certain amount of price ranges uh, a couple weeks ago. But this is like a good set to have for the 90th anniversary castle set. Which is like 500. Yeah, is it 500? Yeah, 500 dollars. So this would be like a good thing to have because they do come with two forcemen in that set, so you can build up a little forceman army. But I thank you all for watching this video, short little video. And uh, please like and subscribe on this video. Press that bell notification to be upload to be notified when I upload a new video. And as always, I will see you all later.